Howdy everyone, my name is SK Pac-Man and welcome to the end of Pools. This is chapter 6. Uh, last chapter was really spoopy, and I'm recording this right after I recorded 5, so... Right back into the mix. Ooh. Uh, we ended up in a... In a house? Uh, they're fingy pointing. Go that way. I don't like it. I don't. I don't like it. Water in house. Oh, are we gonna get more mannequins? Suck it up and do it. Man up, damn it. Hmm. Are you winning, son? There's no pieces on the chest board. Okay. I don't remember that. Okay. Spooky hallway. Secret tunnel? No. We're not going to sing this. Just kick that shit over. Hmm. Can I sit down? I can. Nope. No, get out of the chair, you dummy. Get out of the chair. Get out. Don't want to sit down. I'm good. Huge and narrow. Why is my walkway so narrow? It looks odd. Hmm. Oh, we're mixing all of the environments this time. I'll take it. Fine. Cool. Bunch of nope. Oh. Ah, the darkness in my left. Just. Mm -mm, nah. It gets worse. It's so much worse. It's like you can't tell what's in there. This this chapter seems very linear. But Very linear. Almost on rails. For the previous chapters, up until about la yeah, yeah, up until about chapter five, it felt open until you got to a certain point where you were supposed to go. This one feels just very linear. And that's probably the point, is it's coming to a some kind of conclusion. Yep, that's where I just was. I think the only option is the slide. Ow! It threw me. Hmm. Big steam room. Big steam rocks. Giant steam rock that looks like brains. The random ass chair. Just a boom. This would be hot as hell just standing next to it. The world's largest steam room. Down. Got it. Cool. Ah, cool. It's unsettling as well. I mean, liminal spaces, it's anyone's game. 
You do li literally anything you want with it for a liminal game. Uh, dining table. Nothing useful there. Where are we going? Yeah, this one seems very, very monotonous. Well, not monotonous, but like... Oh, do I go... Do I go up or down? That door has a way to go, but this also has a way to go. I'm gonna take the pool... first. Ah, that has a slide that comes down here. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, this is totally where I want to be. Oh, this is exactly... Oh, this is exactly where I want to be. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, I hate it. Oh, I hate it. Houses standing on houses. Ah, oh, I hate it. This this look right here is the th that's all you get out of this whole playthrough. Just, what message is it trying to send? What is it trying to tell me? Do I go left or up? I'm feeling up. Oh, something loaded in. Felt a hitch. Oh, darkness, my old friend. When will this bullshit end? I am stuck in the goddamn back rooms. Hmm. I'm past a pipe. to the water. That is a pillow? Does not look like a comfortable bed. I know I know I I say I can sleep just about anywhere, but not on a concrete pillow. Hello. More concrete pillows. Is this where the mannequins sleep? Probably. I'm probably about to be chased by fucking mannequins. Up we go. I'm faster, dummy. I know your hands and feet are wet. Just do it. Oh, I hate it. It's becoming more and more unhinged. Like, I recognize some of these places, but... Like, they're bits and pieces of other levels all stitched together. Okay, it's suddenly become less linear. Spooky hallway? Sure. Why not? Oh! Another maze. Clock. And a chair. Sure. What in the actual hell? Why is there a sheep in here? Liminal space. I shouldn't be questioning. Is there something at the end of that hallway? Or should I get out? 
suppose I can just jump back in if there's something down there. There's not. Okay. Heading up. That sounds like... Oh, it is diamond plate metal. What the fuck? They're hanging by their mouth. Ugh. Oh, no thanks. Mm -mm. I do appreciate the accuracy of the lore material versus how you step and what it sounds like. Trying to avoid those grates. Oh, and we're back here. Lovely. So this isn't the way to go. Drippy pipe. Is that the way to go? We went up here and we saw the these guys. Is there somewhere this way I could go? No. No, there's no other way to go. Okay. And this falls down into... Yes. Lovely. Oh my god. That is terrifying. Just gonna scooch by ya. Excuse me. If you move, I'm gonna shit myself. go this way. Oh my god. Oh! Hi! Art? Art? A screenshot? With a duck? Children's art. Screenshots, more children's art. Big chair. Hmm. Lovely. What is this? Nothing. Now that's art. Now, now that's art. The big nothing. Hmm, this ain't art. Nope. That's scary. That's spooky. Nah, I'm good. Turning my headphones down just a little bit more. Hello? Train tunnel? With a bed on it. Because why not? Sir. Scaring the children. No other way to go but in and across. And up we go. Oh, whoa, what? It's moving. Lovely. Wherever we are is alive. It's just meat. It's 
sure. Wish I could have walked on the edge there. Would have been faster. This is almost peaceful. Again, this one felt very on rails, except for a couple of small sections. I'm okay, I'm willing to bet two things. One, there's going to be some kind of chase sequence with the mannequins at the end. And two, we either pop out the same way we fell into the first level or there's some kind of twist ending because we have we have camera controls, right? Some other twist ending of it being some kind of found footage or whatever. Calling it now. This is a cool effect, though. The floor coming in. I like that. See? 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 This is us falling into the, the first level. What do you want to bet? Oh, the first level didn't have the little scoopy things, so I don't think this is us falling in the first level. Never mind. Sure. Dark chair. Long hallway. Nope. Nope. Yep, they're gonna follow me. That gave me the willies. Oh, I can't go that way. Mmm, you know what the willies are, right? That tingly feeling in your groin grundle area. Yeah, I recognize this place. We've been here before. Can't go that way. Gotta go this way. I'm banking on the mannequin chase sequence. Even though the description of the game on Steam says there's no monsters, the mannequins are the monsters. Clearly. Another fucking maze. I hate mazes so much. Hi. How's it going? Hey. Are you trying to lead me to the place I'm supposed to go? Yep. All right. They're going to pop into... Yep, there they are. Yeah, that's not okay. Oh my god. Hi. They're just going to pop into existence. Yep. Oh. Oh, hi. I am out of control there. Here they come. Are you pointing at the table? Hmm, have a seat. Oh no, I set the camera down. Oh, I... No way, I walked back to the... Called it. <laughs> I fucking called it. Pools. That was an incredible game, Tensori. You guys did an incredible job. The graphics were amazing. They were so good that I had to, like, 
uh, dumbed down my setup because the overlay green screen stuff wasn't working too well with it. Um, but yeah, this game was nuts. It was so good. The tension there on the last scene with the the uh, I can't even think. I can't even talk. The tension with those mannequin sh uh, statue things was so good. It was so spot on. Uh, and I understand the the back and forth of getting lost and then get finding your way and then there's like a maze area at the beginning and then you find whatever path it is out. That's cool. Uh, but this has been Fools. If you enjoyed this series, if you want to see me do more stuff like this, uh, suggest games in the comments. I look at all comments. I respond to most of them. If you enjoyed this series, leave a like, share it with a friend. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button. See you guys next time.